Imagine you are late for work and you need to get across the city in a hurry. You don't want to deal with traffic jams, road accidents, or parking problems. What if you could just hop into your flying car and soar above the streets, reaching your destination in minutes? Sounds like science fiction, right? Well, not anymore. In this video, we will explore how flying cars are becoming a reality and what they will mean for our future. Hello and welcome to Future Technology, the channel where we explore the latest innovations and trends that will shape our world. Today we are going to talk about flying cars, one of the most anticipated and exciting technologies of the 21st century. Flying cars are not a new idea. They have been featured in many movies, books, and games for decades. But until recently, they were mostly considered a fantasy or a gimmick. The challenges of designing, building, and operating a vehicle that can both drive on the road and fly in the air were too daunting and costly for most inventors and companies. But things have changed in the past few years. Thanks to advances in engineering, materials, software, sensors, batteries, and electric motors, flying cars are becoming more feasible and affordable than ever before. Several startups and established players in the automotive and aerospace industries are developing and testing prototypes of flying cars that can take off and land vertically, like helicopters or drones, or horizontally, like airplanes. Some of these vehicles are already available for pre-order or reservation, with plans to launch commercial services or deliveries by 2025. So what will flying cars look like in 2050? How will they work? How will they affect our lives? Let's find out. First of all, flying cars will not be like the ones you see in movies. They will not be simply cars with wings or propellers attached. They will be more like hybrid vehicles that can switch between different modes of transportation depending on the situation. For example, some models will have retractable wings or rotors that can fold or unfold when needed. Others will have detachable modules that can separate or combine to form different configurations. Some will even have the ability to transform into boats or submarines. Secondly, flying cars will not be driven by humans. They will be controlled by artificial intelligence and connected to a network of sensors, satellites, and traffic management systems that will ensure safety and efficiency. Humans will only need to input their destination and preferences, and the vehicle will do the rest. The vehicle will also communicate with other vehicles and infrastructure to avoid collisions and optimize routes. Thirdly, flying cars will not be owned by individuals. They will be part of a shared mobility service that will allow users to access them on demand or subscribe to them for a period of time. Users will be able to choose from different types of vehicles depending on their needs and preferences. For example, they could opt for a solo pod for a quick trip across town, a family car for a weekend getaway, or a luxury limo for a special occasion. Fourthly, flying cars will not be limited to urban areas. They will also enable new possibilities for travel and exploration in rural and remote regions. They will allow people to access places that are otherwise difficult or impossible to reach by conventional means of transportation. For example, they could visit natural wonders, historical sites, or exotic destinations that are off the grid or have no roads or airports. Fifthly, flying cars will not only change how we move around but also how we live and work. They will create new opportunities for economic development, social interaction, and environmental sustainability. They will reduce congestion, pollution, noise, and accidents on the ground. They will increase productivity, convenience, comfort, and fun in the air. They will also enable new forms of architecture, urban planning, entertainment, and education that will take advantage of the three-dimensional space. In conclusion, flying cars are not a distant dream but a near reality. By 2050, they will be an integral part of our transportation system and our society. They will transform our mobility and our lifestyle in ways we can hardly imagine today. They will make us fly higher than ever before. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please like it and subscribe to our channel for more content on the future of technology. And don't forget to leave your comments below. What do you think about flying cars? Would you like to ride one? Where would you go? Let us know your thoughts.